In this video, I will show you some of the options that are helpful during the physical layout in Cadence Virtuoso. This is the Virtuoso layout suit. The first option is click on options and select net name to display. It displays in white color. Already it is in white color. You can change this to yellow. Now we change the color to yellow. Similarly, if you want to change it to another colors, you can change. So this is the first option. The second option is smart display. You can click on schematic and see the change. Now the layout changed to schematic mode and the other sides are in dim mode. You can click on hide. Only schematic mode is enabled and only pins these pins are shown. Similarly, you can go for abstracted. Click on apply. Connectivity lines, you can have different options are available. You can observe all of this. Flight lines. Just select one by one and you can click on apply to see the changes. This is the abstract view. So there are two options. One is called schematic. The second one is abstracted. You can select one of them and see the changes. Now it is in schematic mode. So let me turn off and come back to the original layout. The third one is dynamic display. This is used during the measurement. Select show info balloon and apply. You can observe that we have a red box. This is the PMOS and its information balloon contains information regarding the PMOS. Now it is PM0. Library is GPDK90, cell is PMOS, 1 volt, and view is layout. And if I select this, it is a polysilicon drawing. And select this, it shows the net name is VO. So, information balloon will give you the information regarding each and every layer. The second option is measurement display click on this and click on dynamic measurement click apply so this is this you can use during the layouts so select the metal one and draw any metal. You can see this. That option is nothing but highlighting of net with a color. You can go to this dynamic display. Right now you have the dynamic display with the yellow color. If you want, you can change it to red. It changed to red mode. It gives me the what is the length, width, and layer, area, everything. Each and every information is given. I can select another layer also. Like go to the metal 2. 
and let me draw this or use rectangle for that go to this create shape press rectangle so now it is giving all the information pertaining to this rectangle the another option that i am going to show you is highlight aligned edges on enable this you can see this apply whenever i select these edges the color will be in green or let me come to this layout let me go again dynamic display it is in green color let me change it to yellow or white apply during the selection it shows it's in a white color the other option what i am going to show you is go to the view click on show coordinates and if i want to see the coordinates of this rectangle select this or if i want to see the coordinates of this entire click on this you will have the coordinates of this the other option is go to the view click on show angles if i select this it gives me the angle the inner angle is 90 degree and the total exterior angle is 270 it works for all the layers you can draw it can work for even polygons the previous option which was go to the dynamic option this option you can see the white color white color let me change this color again to blue right now the selected color is blue that is to select only the edges highlighting of the edges and you can measure the angle by going into the view tab and show angles so it shows the angle of this and coordinates in this way these options are helpful while performing the layout in cadence virtual